happening now. Dozens of protesters just wrapped up taking their message to city council. They want more to keep bikers and pedestrians safe. K2 Stephen Mayer is live downtown. Stephen, these protesters have been busy today. They sure have. This was the fourth and the final protest of the day. About a dozen people came down with their bicycles and handmade signs trying to get the word out when it comes to safety for bicyclists and pedestrians. Let's go ahead and show you some video that we got earlier today of these people that as they were trying to get their message to city council. They went to the city council and several speakers got very emotional saying there's things the city can do right now to protect everyone who uses the streets. You don't have to wait for millions of dollars. You don't have to wait for a street fee. These are things that you could start implementing now with just a little paint, some enforcement, a change of attitude, and political will. And right after that meeting, they pass out flyers to the city council detailing the five improvements, which are restore street safety budgets, divert cars off neighborhood greenways, better enforce speed limits, investigate all crashes involving vulnerable users, and do more to stop repeat offenders from hurting other people. That's the five key points they say the city council can take care of right now to help keep people safer on the streets. And we also spoke with Peabot. They say they hear those concerns. No more needs to be done. But they also pointed out that this city council has devoted more to safety improvements than any city council dating back to the 1980s. So they say they hear the message, but they're also trying to get something done. Reporting live tonight, Stephen Mayer, K2 News. Stephen, thank you.